Can someone tell me why everyone is getting so freaking comfortable with, you know, being delusional online? Not only that, they do it in a way that they make you believe it to the extent that, 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 that you think is the actual truth. And whatever you believe before, if you don't have a preconceived knowledge of the topic, you will eat that. And that is what's going on in the fitness industry, at least. I know it happens in all the industries, but right now, like what I'm seeing online is crazy. And with the rise of people getting famous with doing, you know, I'm not gonna say the word because like YouTube doesn't like it. I only have like 200 subscribers and they stop my videos every time I talk about the topic. Now, in today's video, I'm gonna go over one particular person that um, I don't have any problems with him or anything. I just saw a video that um, of him. He went viral with it like a few days ago. And the problem I have is with the comment section. He actually goes over why you should like, uh, let's get right into it. You'll see. When you start training properly, nothing wrong with that. Perfect. Right now, when you go on the comment section, you mean when you're starting taking gear, don't give people full expectations. And this is what he says. Right. I've had so many comments about this and, uh, it's kind of crazy to say, yeah, gear doesn't just turn you into a bodybuilder like yes there's, there's there is studies that there is studies that show see he says gear doesn't turn you into a bodybuilder here's the thing oh uh, jack it does not yes you are correct however the fact that you are trying to promote that you can get a transformation with the previous caption that we saw right train properly that's that's all you said there and someone that is not knowledgeable in the area will most likely eat that Oh yeah, if I train hard, I can get to this level. Uh, that's not the case. That you put on muscle if you, if you just take gear and not do any training, obviously, because it's a muscle building drug. But do you know any bodybuilder who looks good and doesn't lift weights but injects? I don't think there's a single one out there, but you guys like to discredit stuff and uh, just cry in the comments about steroids but you can't ever fathom that someone actually put in years of hard work. This might be really hard to believe, but you actually have to lift weights for years and years, eat the right food. And if you also take your gear, you will look good. You can't just take your gear and uh, not do any of the hard work. And the narrative that all these people have, the people that take the PEDs is that you still need to put the work in and you need to eat the right foods and you need to do this, this and the third. Yes, you do have to do that. However, the time of recovery, that's the number one thing that you guys have. We natural people don't have the time of recovery that you guys have. And that makes you go to the gym harder and train harder than before. It's not because we're lazy. It's because our joints cannot hold the load that we are putting, the stress that we're putting in it, because we don't have the recovery time that all these chemicals are doing to your body. That's the only thing that they don't, they don't talk about. They don't say that. Why? Because it doesn't fit the narrative that they have. Uh, yeah, we, it's the same as natural, just a little bit better. No, 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 no. It's actually like 10,000 times different. The narrative that everyone has with when, whenever it comes to taking PEDs is that, yes, you need to work out hard, do everything that a natural is doing. They don't say the, oh, the main important thing is that it'll take them two, three, even four times faster to get to the point of getting, let's say, one pound of muscle than someone that is natural. And that's a problem. Not only that, you know, you're damaging your organs and you get big nipples, you get back acne, you get all the bad stuff. But they don't talk about that. Why? Because it gives them clout. It gives them to the point of, yeah, I'm a bodybuilder, whatever. But you don't see them winning anything. The only bodybuilder you probably know is that guy, right? That's it. But you got people like this guy telling you, if you train hard, you can look like this. No, no, no. If you train hard and you do performing enhancing supplements, you will look like this with a little bit of genetics. If you agree with that, please hit the like button. Uh, check my other videos. Stay natural. See ya.